Hello everyone, I'm Augusta Myers. Let's take a brief look at what's been going on in City of Albuquerque related news lately. Last week, the City Council Finance and Government Affairs Committee unanimously passed legislation to establish a mobile speeding enforcement program in Albuquerque. After months of community engagement, mobile speed enforcement was among the top recommendations that came out of the Vision Zero initiative, a plan to reduce traffic fatalities and create safer streets. It now goes to the full council for a vote. And speaking of traffic, the City Council and the Department of Municipal Development unveiled new roadway improvements on a troubled stretch of West Side Roadway. About $44,000 will be used to improve visibility and slow down drivers near Irving and Ventana Ridge Northwest. The neighborhood worked closely with the city, making sure traffic improvements eased safety concerns of residents. The Veterans Wall of Honor at City Senior Centers has gone digital. Since 2014, Senior Affairs has proudly displayed pictures recognizing their registered members who are veterans of the armed forces at the city's six senior centers and two multi-generational centers. As the tradition has grown, fitting all local heroes on the wall became a challenge. The new digital wall of honor and slideshow means the program can continue to grow. And calling all Albuquerque poets, the city's Department of Arts and Culture wants poetry submissions for an upcoming anthology. Poets currently living here, or those who did for three or more years, are invited to submit up to three poems inspired by Albuquerque to be considered for inclusion in an historical publication next year. Submissions will be accepted through mid-September. Find out more at cbq.gov. And that will do it for this week's City News for Now. Be sure to join us again for our next installment right here on One Albuquerque Media. I'm Augusta Myers. Thanks for joining me.